Hello everyone, I'm meteorologist Jesse McNeil and welcome to summer. Today starts the official start of summer, even though Memorial Day weekend we say the unofficial start. And of course our temperatures have been there. Uh, the official start is today. In fact, it begins exactly at 451. That's when the sun will be at its highest peak in the sky for the northern hemisphere. We have seasons because our Earth tilts on its axis and it's when the northern hemisphere where we live is tilted toward the sun that we enter our summer months and we are there today. As a matter of fact, it's called the solstice because it's a soul meaning sun and then uh, stand still or at a still point and today is where we'll see the sun at its highest point in the sky. Now, consequently, even though it's going to be at its highest point, we really don't feel the hotter temperatures until we get to July and August because it takes time for those sun rays to begin to heat the Earth's atmosphere. And so we have our hottest months during July and August. This is the longest day of the year. We'll see 14 hours, 23 minutes of daylight or sunlight today. And after that, starting tomorrow, the days get shorter and shorter and shorter. In fact, all the way down to our winter solstice where we get down to nine hours and five minutes of sunlight. That's going to be good news for folks like myself who have to go to bed early. No more of these 9 p.m. daylight times, you know. Mm. Enjoy the summertime, all that ice cream, pools, lakes, whatever you do to keep yourself cool. In fact, our temperatures will be going up over the next couple of days, well into the 90s this weekend and into next week. Enjoy today and have a great safe summer.